A big relief for Bilkis Banuna. In the case, the Supreme Court, in fact, has said that the remission which was granted to the 11 convicts in the rape case has to be cancelled and that the Gujarat government is not the competent authority uh, to have passed the order in the first place. Now, we're also learning that the Supreme Court, in fact, has said uh, that the 11 convicts in the case should surrender uh, to prison within two weeks, upholding rule of law and saying that the rule of law must prevail. I have my colleague Arvind joining us with more details. Arvind, take us through the latest observation by the Supreme Court. Uh, uh, the fourth very complex question, of course, has been answered by the Supreme Court. Now they're saying that rule of law must prevail and that uh, these convicts must surrender back to prison uh, within two weeks. Yeah, Arti, today Supreme Court has ordered all the 11 convicts to uh, be sent back to jail. They have to surrender uh, within two weeks. Supreme Court underlining the fact that rule of law must prevail has quashed the remission order that was uh, given by the Gujarat government uh, ordering premature release of all the 11 convicts in the Bilkis Banu uh, gang rape and also murder case. Today, Supreme Court has not just quashed the remission order but has also said that all the 11 convicts should be sent back to jail. That means that they have to surrender within a period of two weeks and then they will have to serve their jail term. So now what's left for them? With the Supreme Court holding that the Maharashtra government is the competent government uh, in deciding the remission plea. So the 11 convicts have to surrender within two weeks. They will have to be sent back to jail. From jail then they can uh, apply for remission. They can apply for remission with the uh, state government of Maharashtra. But for now, they have to surrender and they will have to be sent back to jail uh, 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 within a period of two weeks. And Supreme Court upholding that the rule of law must prevail has held that the order of remission that was granted by the state of Gujarat is null and void and that has been quashed by the Supreme Court.